Hey YouTube, this is your girl Simply Love, and I'm here to do a end of the retrograde reading for you, and this is going to be for the sign of Aquarius, Gemini, and Libra, okay, and I'm going to deliver some messages for you uh, from your spirit guides, I've been having like dreams and things like that, like how we were talked about, you know, in your reading, and um, now I'm, you know, getting something to wear, um, they're asking me to do a, a give you some personal uh, information that they have for you. Okay, these are personal messages for you, Aquariuses, Gemini's, and Libras. Please pay pay close attention. Uh, sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs as well. Okay, so um, here you are. The messages from your angels. I'm going to shuffle first and tell you what they are feeling. What message they have for you? What they see for you, okay, um, as you're going through this lifetime, like what they see uh, that you can't hear in the physical, okay? So, first one I'm going to do is Aquarius. I'm going to do you Aquarius. Aquarius, what does your loved ones, ancestors, spirit guides have to say to you? What's their message um, for you guys out there who's wondering about a loved one? You miss them. You care about them. You may have had some kind of dreams about them. Let's see what that message is. Let's see if we can clarify it for you. For the sign of Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What's the sign? What is the message for those out there who has been receiving all this information and trying to put it together? What is your direct message, Aquarius, Gemini? I'm sorry for Aquariuses right now. Sorry, Aquarius spirit guys. What are you trying to say to them? What are you, what are you trying to get their attention about? What is you trying to get their attention about? Loved ones. Okay, here it is. It just flew out for Gemini. I'm sorry, Aquarius. I have no more earthly worries, okay? For somebody out there who's been wondering about, you know, what's going on, because a lot of you did respond to when I said um, you've been seeing things, you've been having dreams and things like that, um, been seeing stuff like going by you. That's your spirit, guys, like I said, trying to get your attention, all right? And I've been having dreams and stuff like that as well about other people, okay? So spirit led me to go ahead and make this, this short video not too long uh, after the retrograde, you know, when things is calming down, people calming down and seeing what's really going on and bring the messages in from your loved ones so some of you Aquarius is out there whoever's out on the other side I want you to know that they have no more earthly worries you know nothing here worries them um, the only thing they do is have your best interest at heart that's basically what it, it's that's all they're doing and that's not even a worry because they already see they can see Okay, what other messages do you have, um, Spirit, uh, for the sign of Aquarius, for the loved ones that has passed over, a friend, a family member, um, ancestors way back when? What messages are you trying to give those? With those who have been having those dreams, those who have been seeing you, what messages? Okay, we have Angel Ar Arshara, Arshara. Okay, and, and she says, as far as your Aquarius' additional messages, is that you are spiritual, you are a spiritual teacher, okay? You have the ability to con, uh, console others, to counsel others, and um, help them awaken their spiritual gifts and divine life uh, mission, see? So, you know you Aquarius's that's your nature, is helping people. You can get them. You can get them spiritually back in tune with themselves, um, without force. Okay, you can. You just have that natural ability. So, whoever's passed over that says they have no more worries, you know, and, uh, uh, or no more earthly worries. Um, the message to you from them is saying to you as well that um, 
you know, you have these gifts and ability. This is what you're supposed to be doing in life, helping other people through your spirituality, uh, getting them back in their spiritual. A lot of you Aquariuses could be readers or, you know, empaths and things like that. Remember all you guys been sending me them emails. Of all, Just about all of you been sending me emails saying, yeah, you've been going through this. Were you seeing um, different things like how I've been doing um, they are nothing but your spirit guys it's like I said trying to get your attention if you guys need a personal private reading to really really get into detail what's going on because but this is just as work you know this is for like worldwide uh, it's going to reach some people some is not okay Aquarius Aquarius what's the final message from um, those who are crossed over what's their final message to you um, that they've been trying to reach to you or those who you are speaking to out there far as been getting these um, signs and things like and seeing things um, seeing you guys what, you, what messages are you trying to get through to them now that the retrograde has ended what sign what are you trying to get across to those who's been having these dreams and seeing these different things which are you guys trying to deliver a message to them okay There it goes. All right, Aquarius. All right, the final message that your uh, ancestors or relative, friend, whoever you've been thinking about, you know, and, and been seeing these, you know, dreams or whatever, they're saying use your natural healing abilities again. It matches up with this. You know, they're already telling you that they don't have no more or earthly worries, Aquarius, okay? They're telling you you need to use your natural abilities, which is helping people. Helping people, counseling people, okay? Uh, awakening their spiritual gifts. Spiritual gifts, not, not this physical world stuff, but the spiritual world stuff. That's what lasts forever. And use your natural healing abilities, okay? Um... Angel Raphael, want to thank you for uh, clearing, um, clearing, guiding, encouraging, and supporting uh, my my leading work, my healing work. Okay, so they're saying thank you. You know, your family members, friends, your angel guides, your ancestors are saying thank you for letting them use you to help with the abilities to help people be, be so you can counsel them, heal them. Uh, encourage them and bring them back to their spirituality so they can have a better way of living because whoever it is, is that's crossed over you know they don't have any more worries anymore and they know that you're not either but they want to guide you to what where you're supposed to be going and what you're supposed to be doing so that's for you Aquarius is from your angel guides your spirit guides and your loved ones who passed over so now let's go ahead and do Gemini, sorry y'all. <laughs> Gemini. Okay, Gemini, Gemini. Spirit guys, what messages do you have um, for those who's been having dreams and been seeing you guys? Uh, they're wondering what's going on. They're wondering what messages are supposed to be coming out of this. Now that we're at the end of the re retrograde where people's minds are kind of like coming back to normal okay and they received all the downloads what messages do you have for them okay here we go Gemini whoever's passed over whoever's been trying to communicate with you through your dreams um, through what you're seeing all this kind of stuff it could be your ancestors it could be somebody you know a friend a relative and, and um, your spirit guides as well okay what they're saying is you have nothing to feel uh, guilty about for whoever that resonates out there about a loved one who passed over or you know a relative or an ancestor they're saying you don't have anything to feel guilty about okay and that's for you Gemini's out there who this can uh, relate with okay let's see what other messages they may have for you okay spirit guides ancestors what other messages do you have for the sign of gemini what do you need them to know what have you been trying to contact them what do you want to tell them what is it that you want to tell them spirit guides ancestors friends relatives 
What is it that you're trying to tell them? Where, what, you, what direction are you trying to lead them in? What's, what's the message for the sign of Gemini? Two fell out there, so just for a second. Sign of Gemini, what would be the messages? What would be the messages? Spirit, what would be the messages? What are you trying to say to those who've been having those dreams and seeing, seeing you guys not understanding what's going on? What is the message now that the retrograde has passed? <clears throat> What's the clear message that you have for them that you want them to know? Thank you. There we go. All right. The additional message is from Angel, your spirit, Angel, Bridget. Okay. It says, caution is... Um, warranted look deeper into this situation before processing further oh, i'm sorry for proceed before you proceed further um there's a caution that your loved one wants you to know or your ancestors for the sign of gemini so really look deeper into something um maybe you want to get to yourself be the hermit and sit back and, and go with inside yourself so you can really get this clear message about what they warning you about there is a caution out there for some of you um your spirit guides want you to know some of you may already know what it is okay 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 what's the last message you have for the sign of uh, gemini for those who crossed over friends families relatives ancestors what messages are you trying to what is this caution card for what do you want some of those Geminis out there you're speaking with to be in caution about. What is it? What's the caution? What's the caution for the sign of Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs? Thank you. Or whatever additional messages you may have. Yeah, I'm hearing some of them saying, you know, you know, you know, because see, there's a light there. They've shown you a light. You've been seeing something in your dreams or something you know something about. So they're, you know, just telling you, be aware of something you need to look deeper into. Use your intuition. Your intuition or your guides is what's inside, okay? Okay, here we go. That one in the fall. I was holding on to it. <laughs> so it's like you got this Gemini, you got this uh, sunlight card. Okay? Sunlight. Sorry. Um, this is uh, Dear Archangel Raphael. Okay, it says, Please help me enjoy the benefits of sunlight in. Um, and safe and healthy ways in safe and healthy ways that are talking about your eating habits okay so some of you may be has something to do with you know health wise and they're cautioning you some kind of way for some of you that you may need to change your diet the way you eat what you digest you may need to get into some type of healthy ways of eating so I believe that's the message for some of you out there if not it's for some of you I believe you already know and um, whatever you know something that you don't have to that they're saying directly to you guys you don't have nothing to feel guilty about but there is some type of caution for you they're saying they've been nudging at you and when you have some kind of caution it may like I said have something to do with your diet for some of you all right so that was for you uh, Gemini's now we're going to get to Libra we're going to get to Libra let's see what your message has been trying to come through to you through spirit your angel guides your ancestors the sign of Libra what is the messages that you have for the sign of Libra's out there Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus um, from relatives okay relatives spirit guides ancestors they all work together the most high they all work together they all work together as one 
What are the messages that you've been trying to get through to them? What do you want them to know? For those who want relate, who what do you want them to know? What do you want them to know? Thank you. Hey spirit guys, what do you want them to know? What is it? There you go. Okay, for some of you out there, you uh, Libras, okay? I was met by so many loving people. So whoever you thinking about or has some type of dream about or it could be your aunts. It could be, you know, people way back, your ancestors even, okay? They want you to know that um, they was met by a lot of loving people. They're safe. They're good. They're good, okay? They was met by so many loving people. Okay, let's see what other... Um, messages they have for you here what other messages do you have for the sign of the libra from their ancestors those who passed over those who are looking after them sun moon rising and venus for libra what are the messages you have spirit ancestors universe what is the messages you've been trying to get? What 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 are you trying to relay? The messages you're trying to relay for the sign of Libra. It takes a while for them to speak up sometimes. Because I think I caught them off guard with this. Okay? So please bear with me. Um, like I said, I don't like to have control of the cards and stuff and pick them and all that kind of shit. That's just me. I don't, you know, not knocking nobody else. Just me. So, it takes a minute. Let spirit speak. You always let spirit speak. Care how long it takes. Okay. What messages are they trying? There they go. All right, now they have uh, Archangel Sonia or just Angel Sonia. Sorry about that. Okay, it's a spirit anyway. This says, I bring you a message from the deceased loved one. Okay, we already got that. They were to you, Libras, they are. They were met by a lot of loving people. Okay, so here's another message. It says, um, I am happy, at peace, and I love you very much. Please don't worry about me. There's another message for you guys from someone that you've been thinking about or something, having dreams about, an ancestor, you know, somebody that's crossed over. You know, they said, you know, they, they were met by many beautiful people, many loving people, and then they're saying, don't worry about them. They're saying, don't worry about them. I bring you a message from the deceased loved one. They're happy, at peace, and they love you very much. So don't worry. Okay? That's a strong message for you Libras out there, whoever may be suffering from a loss. Don't suffer like that. These people, they're, they're crossed over. They're trying to help you. Don't worry about them. They're okay. They're trying to help you. They're in a position where they can help you out. So call on them to help you. All right, here's your uh, last message, Libra, for those. Okay, laughter is the best medicine. Dear Archangel Raphael, thank you for uh, reminding me to detach and find the humor and worry with worry within every human drama. <laughs> I think I'm reading that right. Yeah, the letters are so weird looking. They should put them, leave them like this instead of that little cursive stuff. But anyway, that's what they're saying. Just laugh, you know. Find the humor and stuff. Don't be so sad. If a lot of you leavers are sad because of someone who passed over and stuff, they're saying not to. Mm mm. They're in a good place. They're safe. They're happy. They love you. Help. They want you to call on them for help. And then they want you to look at the, you know, bright side of, of the picture. Look at the big picture here that they're okay. And they want you to laugh and have fun and not be so serious because it's not that serious. Call on them. They'll tell you. They'll let you know. 
So I hope that ho helped you guys out. If you ever need a personal private reading with me, you guys, you can go ahead and uh, look below. I have that information there. Um, I hope this resonated to some of you out there. Um, and I'm going to move on to the next group. All right. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye. <laughs>